Hey there all craft beer lovers, it's Cider Fanatic here, back with another beer review. Today guys we are taking a look at an offering from Firestone Walker Brewing Company from the United States. Uh, and this is their Agrestic American Wild Red Ale, coming to us in a 375 milliliter bottle with a traditional wooden cork and a birdcage there. Uh, the, beer, the beer itself clocks in at 6.10% 6, 6 ABV to be exact. Uh, it is aged in uh, both French and American uh, oak barrels. And the ratio is 80% uh, French oak and 20% American oak. It has been matured for 12 to 15 months. I'm opening as I'm speaking here. Uh, and they are using a proprietary blend actually of a Brett and uh, Lactobacillus. There's the bird cage, it's off. So it sounds like a really, really interesting beer, guys. Let's see if this cork will pop off. Yeah, I think it's moving a little bit here. There we go. There we go. Really, really nice bit of smoke on the bottle opening. And the beer is going down. I'm using my big snifter glass for this one, guys, because this is, uh, I believe, a very, very exclusive beer. There we go. Gonna see if there's... I want to get everything in there. There we go. So I stirred it around quite a bit to get everything in there. There we go. Yeah, so guys, what do we have? There you go. In view, approximately one and a half finger there of a fluffy but yet very quickly dissipating head. Uh, nice bubbles there. Very, very nice, hazy, uh, ruby, almost ruby red and a bit dark brownish. Can you see, guys? See, can you see all the yeast there? Looks pretty nice. The yeast is falling down. Loads and loads of yeast. Let's get the aroma on this one. <sighs> yeah, so l that lovely vinegary, woody smell. <sighs> oh yeah, a little bit of cherry in there. <sighs> fruity. Kind of a tart, fruity smell. Yeah, lactic acid. Smells very, very nice. Yeah, smells very nice. So with that said, guys, cheers. And here's to Firestone Walker Brewing Company and their Aggressic Wild American Red Ale. Cheers. Mm. Mm. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, a complex beer for sure. Let's go for another one. Mm. 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 Oh yeah, what a lovely aftertaste. What a lovely aftertaste. You're gonna, oh yeah, you got an aftertaste containing oak, touch of vanilla in there, cherry, maybe a hint of blackberries in there. Alongside that lactobacillus uh, feel to the to to the taste, very very nice guys, very very nice beer, complex. Uh, mm, you got a little bit of that kind of mouth puckering uh, initially, but not super super much though. Uh, very very nice, lovely sour characteristics to this one. A tendency to be mouth puckering, but not overwhelming. Mm. Very, very nice. Look at the beer. Look at the beer. Oh, yeah. Let's go for another one. Mm. 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 Very nice. I think that wood, that oak comes out very nicely. Not overwhelming, not overpowering. Very, very nice. Very balanced indeed. Yeah, got a little bit of, as I said, 
cherry, vanilla, blackberry thing going on in the aftertaste. And the wood comes out again. Very, very nice, guys. A very, very nice beer. Final sip. And then we'll rate this one. Yeah, nice, fruity, tart. Mm. Yeah, I, got, I mean, guys, if you're, if you're into sours, you will definitely love this one. It's a very, very nice, complex sour with a lot of solid acidity to it. Yeah, touch of vanilla, touch of oak. Yeah, blackberry, blackberries in there, cherry, vanilla, the whole nine yards. You love that lactobacillus coming forth. Very nice. Uh, the only thing that is a little bit uh, on the downside, I would say, it's the price point. Uh, Firestone Walker beers are very, very expensive, and so was this one. So I paid something like around $12 for this one. So they're very, very pricey, only for 375 a milliliter bottle but very very nice guys love the traditional artwork as well there very very nice so definitely a solid if you like uh, sour ales and uh, wild ales that was everything i had for today guys uh, rating wise i'm gonna give this a four out of five it's a four out of five see you next time guys have a good one